entertainment audition requirements clearly specify that the agency is only looking for male trainees. While producer Bang Shihyuk never confirmed, his boys only policy may be from the complete and utter failure of Glam, Big Hit Entertainment's first girl group ever. Before BTS happened, producer Bang Shihyuk, in partnership with Source Music, decided to create a girl group. July of 2012, Glam debuted as a collaborative work, with Big Hit Entertainment producing and Source Music managing the group. The initial debuting group consisted of five members. Glam performed Bang Shi Hyuk's and P-Dog's debut title track, Party, XXO, with Siu, a vocaloid, whose voice belongs to one of the group members, Dahi. Post-promotion, member Trinity abruptly left the group in 2012. While Source Music explained the reason is personal, fans were aware of the fact that she was rumored to have been a Sasareng, extreme fan, of Super Junior's Lee Tuk. Trinity is said to have harassed Lee Tuk until shortly before debuting. Ad Choice as advertising in red invented by Teeds as a four-member group, Glam returned in 2013 with I Like That, produced by Bang Shi Hyuk, P Dog, and BTS's Room. The group promoted this song and one other, in front of the mirror, without much success. By February of 2014, Glam released Special Gift, Give It To You, a track that became the group's last. While the group was not excelling, the members were working hard to stay together. This effort shattered when member Dahi was found to be involved in one of the nation's biggest scandals of the year with a married actor Lee Byung Hun. By September of 2014, Dahi, also referred to as her real name Kim Si Won throughout the investigation, was arrested for threatening Lee Byung Hun. She, and an accomplice who was found to be model Lee Ji Yun, requested the actor to pay 4.5 million US dollars in exchange of a video recorded at a private gathering. This video was said to show Lee Byung Hun making lewd comments and being inappropriate. When Lee Byung Hun reported Dahee to the police, she looked up flight tickets to escape the investigation. The authority issued a warrant, officially arresting Dahee on September 3, 2014. From then on, Dahee submitted multiple written statements reflecting on her actions and asked for leniency. By January of 2015, the case found Dahee guilty of attempted threat. During the first trial, she was sentenced to a year of imprisonment. When she appealed, the court re-sentenced her to a year of imprisonment and two years of probation. She ended up getting out on a $20,000 USD bail, made possible because Lee Byung Hun didn't want harsh punishment. Your browser does not support video. At this point, Big Hit Entertainment confirmed the group has nullified the contract and officially disbanded, stating, with one of the members involved in a legal controversy, the agency no longer finds it possible to keep this group going and decided to release the members as requested. In May 2018, Dahi became a broadcast jockey on Afrika TV, with a little over 4,000 channel followers. Your browser does not support video. I've been working part-time gigs and modeling. I've missed singing though. I used to do Instagram Lives, but a couple of my friends helped me set this up. Dahi the agency's supporters also believe, aside from the whole glam issue, that there is no reason for Big Hit Entertainment to risk producing a girl group again, especially when it now has the know-how of managing a boy group like BTS into global success. GOT7 confirmed to guest on, Good Day New York.